Well, the great New Zealand dance masala is set to hit our small screens this Saturday. Competitors will battle it out on stage as they showcase Bollywood classical and traditional Indian dance styles. This promises to be the most colourful and lively show on TV, and it's hosted by the fabulous Colin Mathura Jeffrey, who joins us now. Welcome, yes, Colin. Welcome. Thank you. Thank it you. Is Always lovely to have you in the studio because you just bring a certain amount of style. Well, you bring a huge amount of style. <laughs> oh, and I, I looked over at you when I said that, Mike, and I did not mean to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's lovely to have you here. It's so great to be here. So how did the whole show come about? What happened? How, what's it about? Well, uh, the show is it's one of those incredible shows that's actually about modern New Zealand and, uh, and ethnic diversity. So it's not just about Indians performing Indian dances, it's actually about the greater community coming in and up to the challenge to do these Bollywood and classic Indian dances. In a reality TV show, I think that's, that's a promising way of where we could go. You're so lively, colourful and entertaining, we probably don't need the dancers for the rest of the show. But I'm really excited. So is it a competition? Do they get voted off each week? How does that work? Exactly. It's one of those reality TV shows. And, and you know, maybe I shouldn't say this. The, the, I've done New Zealand's Exit Model and I've done Hottest Home Baker and I appeared on America's Exit Model. The one aspect I don't really like about reality TV, and you would know this, is mm. the voting off. Yeah. Um, because there's a lot of sadness involved. And you're like, oh, come on. But actually, we do that. We mm. get rid of them. Mike really knows all about that because he was voted off as well. <laughs> <laughs> I did not get a rose <laughs> after season two. Um, you must be excited, though. I mean, this is you all over, really, isn't it? Yeah, I, I think that um, for me, being Anglo-Indian, I'm part Indian, part British, I love the diversity of it. Mm. And I love the, the fact that we get to showcase a cultural level of dance on the mainstream, you know, mm. television. That's fun. So how impressed have you been by the talent? Like, where did the talent come from and who are they? I'm constantly impressed by talent. You know, when you, when you watch them dance and you're getting goosebumps and you're emotional mm. about how wonderful they are when they perform, that's what makes the show special to me. Nothing else, not even me. I've got a huge ego, but the dancers <laughs> and the no. dance performances, that's where the love is. And I'd, say, I'd assume a great mix of different types of people taking on You'd the be challenge. surprised. You yeah. have to tune in to oh, see okay. that because one of the things I wanted was, uh, one of the things I didn't want was to make it just Indian centric. Mm, right. Because India is so diverse in itself, but then we can then be only one type of Indian, North Indian, Punjabi, South Indian, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But what we have is we have the demographic of New Zealand. Was there a genre that stood out when you were going through the rounds? What genres are we going to see? Uh, well, we see the incredible diversity. So we see the classical, the Bharatanatyam, Kathak, and then we go into fusion, Bollywood, and even hip hop. So it's wow. all oh. there. It's uh, and then how do you judge that? Yeah, well, I was going to say, who are the judges? Who are the judges? So we've got three judges. I'll tune in to see them. We've got you know, obviously, we go into the classical uh, representation of a, a dance guru, and then also we have Bollywood dreams dancer. Um, and then we have a, a, a mainstream famous New Zealand dancer. So it's really good. The diversity is there. So the challenge is up for them to battle it out. And I hope there's lots of arguments. I'm actually out of that area. Good. So I don't yeah. see them. But I love a good scrap. Do you? Well, you do. Do you? Can you dance? I well, can you're dance. on Dancing with the Stars, I, weren't you? Yeah, I was on Dancing <laughs> for a hot second. Yeah. But, I, um, <laughs> but I, uh, I danced in a movie. I was Lord Shiva. So I had to learn the Natraj. Um, and that's the the a Bharatanatyam form of dance, classical, and I got it because I apparently I looked like the the god. So well, it's true. Not a bad thing, is it? And have you got any dancers in your family? Yeah, my, well, my family is obviously diverse and they're performers, so right. we have we have dancers, but also we have Latin dancers and and that kind of form in my family. My family is very modern family but I wanted to learn how to do classical dance my sister was a champion ballet dancer growing up so um, yeah. and I learned ballet as well so did my brother as well as martial arts what about the well that's diverse what about the costumes <laughs> uh, they must be quite something yeah and, and I think the thing about this kind of show is the diversity of costuming and how important costuming is because mm. if you look at Bollywood movies and and Hollywood movies which is the South Indian version which is often forgotten um, the the actual decadence of Indian performance is is what's incredible because we are layered literally in outfits so when 
contestants don't meet that challenge, it can be the death of a performance. Mark <laughs> my <laughs> words. Oh, oh, oh. I'm so excited about the show because you're right, it is going to be colourful, it's going to be lively. And, and it's, and I, can, I, can I just say one yes. more thing? It's, um, or a few more things. <laughs> <laughs> Go. It's, um, it's so beautifully shot. You know, we have incredible crew here in New Zealand and they've mm. shot it so beautifully. The little bit I've seen. Is, is wonderful. Okay. And I, I guess there's a, you know, a message in, for New Zealanders, not only about dance, but just about our diversity. Yeah, exactly. And yeah. that's what's wonderful about New Zealand, and that's what's wonderful about this show. Oh, my God. Not this it. show, my show. <laughs> <laughs> and that's also what's wonderful about uh, this show as well. Jeffrey, <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. The Great New Zealand Dance with Silas uh, debuts at 4 p.m. Saturday on 3, and it's a double episode as well, so make sure you check it out. And any episodes that you miss, you can be uh, watch them, of course, on 3 now. Thank you for being on our show. <laughs> thank you. Always Very a pleasure. Much. Such an honour. <laughs>